In this short video, I'm going to define what a computable function is. In short, a computable function is any function that can be computed by a Turing machine. Turing machines take on their input a string of symbols and they run for a while and when they halt, they leave a string of symbols on the tape. So they map one string to another string. Okay, so any function from sigma star to sigma star, in other words, the domain is a sequence, a finite sequence of symbols, and the range is a finite sequence of symbols. So the input x to the computable function is on the tape, the Turing machine runs and always halts, and it leaves a result on the tape. We don't really care too much about acceptance or rejecting. Or rejecting. Uh, if there, we can always uh, make a Turing machine that always accepts by uh, changing it around a little bit. Um, the key thing here is that a Turing machine exists that will always halt. Uh, so if a function is computable, then there exists a Turing machine that will compute the function. A Turing machine that, when given x uh, as its input on the tape, will run and always halt and leave the output f of x on its tape. Then that's a computable function.